Hello everybody, my name is Shredtex and welcome back to Star Sector. So, I'm actually going to just kill these pirates right here, because I was just travelling around hyperspace as you do, and these guys try to kill me. What's up with that? So we're going to take these guys down, and then we're going to move on to our actual objective, which is going to be ninjuring some land from Volkov Industries, everybody. I I'll talk about it after this battle, but I think I found an opportunity which may make us rich. Or at least slightly better off than we are right now. Anyway, let's do this, shall we? My glorious Imperial fleet. I like how I say that, but this ship's not even from this faction, but it's okay. <laughs> Don't worry about it. So I would love, by the way, like when this game gets a bit more uh, like near the end, is maybe add like ship covering, like customization. I want to have bright blue and red ships, everybody. It's going to be glorious. But that's in the future, I guess, maybe. <laughs> if not, I'll make it happen. It's fine. I realized, by the way, that I actually had to play myself and fire this gun. <laughs> I was like, hmm. I seem to be missing half the damage. Okay, these pirates don't really... Oh, they got the uh, mechs. I love how cool these guys look. Though, also, at the same time, I kind of wish I had my own, but it's okay. Let's destroy this guy. Oh, we got this. You gotta feel bad for these poor transport ships. <laughs> There's a reason people don't use these as combat vessels, pirates. There is a reason. Oh, that's not good. Uh-oh. I'm not gonna lie. Because it's a mech, I'm kind of scared of it. Not that one, though. That one was really bad. There's a few enemies left. We've already wiped out pretty much all of them, actually. <laughs> our, our ships are pretty good at this point. They, they get they get the job done, everybody. They get the job done. Though there are still a lot of ships I want to try and replace in my navy. Because we've got a lot of, like, random placeholder ones. And when we get, like, a full power navy, it's going to be pretty badass. But that would be soon. So hopefully sooner rather than later, though. Let's see if we can uh, finish off with a little... Oh, perfect. It's overloaded. Perfect. Nailed it. Cool. Okay, I think we're done here then. Did you need to get killed by one of those pirate vessels? <laughs> I think you did. As cool as that uh, time warping vessel is, it does take a lot of damage, unfortunately. It'd be cool if there's some kind of like hybrid shield phase ship. That'd probably be ridiculously overpowered. Anyway, we managed to kill the pirates. Nice, good start here. Uh, I'm not going to take their stuff, I'm, well, apart from the loot I got, but I'm not going to go around and kill them all off. I'll leave one alive so we can tell the tale of Maximus, everybody. What is happening over here? That was fine. Oh, it disappeared. There used to be a corridor of extreme speed which has deleted itself, but who knows. Anyway, so as I mentioned earlier, there is currently an ongoing surface battle where the Volkov Industries are attacking Diabol Corp, our old faction we played in the last series, over here. I'm going to go over there and I'm going to see if I can just nick it <laughs> so i've actually gone around between episodes like of course i returned from my expedition to the north of the galaxy i managed to get myself some more supplies and stuff and even some marines which is pretty fun look how cool our flag looks by the way i love our faction flag that is a sexy flag so i know i, I know i've had it for a while now but i just want to push people's eyes towards how sexy it is but anyway uh we're gonna be going this way Hopefully with 200 marines and a very weakened defense base, we might be able to just go in there and nick it. <laughs> That's fine anyway. Though I would like to get there without being murdered by all these random storms. We'll have to see what happens. So, attack of victory. Volkov has now taken Zarine mandates. If we go over here, let's go inside. It may not work out as I hope, but... Because I'm pretty sure, at least for a while, there is like a... The, the fleet that stays behind is the invasion fleet. So we may have to fight a big enemy fleet, but we'll have to see. Oh, look how pretty this system is. It is pretty. To say, in real life, by the way, look up some uh, like space nebulas. Because even in real life, they look absolutely stunning. Like, the, the galaxy is a very beautiful place. Even if most of it is literally just this. <laughs> just nothing. It's just complete darkness. But there is sporadic bits of beauty in the galaxy everybody so what is this vic small asset mergers and acquisition armada that sounds to me like an enemy invasion fleet if i've ever seen one so let's go and kill this guy luckily no one's trying to kill us with the station which means the station's currently destroyed let's engage with everybody again i don't want to accidentally lose any units here okay so volkov industries has we've fought them before in the last series they, they kind of got like glass ships they're very very fast and they're very wild. But if you actually hit them, they just blow up. Like that guy right there. <laughs> he got clipped by like a single fighter and he died. But yeah, it's a bit crazy. Anyway, so in that vein, we've got to be a little bit careful. Because it might just murder us in one hit. Or we can kill it in one hit. All we know is someone's going to die. 
Oh. No, 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 no. Don't go. You dare come in with those terrifying things. What was that? What kind of gun was that, man? Okay. There may be a very big scary weapon, but it's okay, because I have this. Ooh, what's this? Whoa! Oh, it's this guy! <laughs> I bet he wasn't expecting that! Oh no, Maximus. You, you might not want to be there anymore, buddy. You kind of go off by yourself. Has it... Why is it turned off? Oh, this is ridiculous. Like I said, very glass cannon faction. <laughs> there... Hmm, I wonder if they're regretting their decision right now to be in this location. They're still alive. I want to see that big cannon again. Shoot me with it. I can take it. He missed. Damn it. <laughs> I can... My body can take it. Hit me. Nice. Bear in mind, that was probably a basic cruiser. I think they got a lot bigger ships than that one, everybody. Oh, what's happening over here? Oh, it's all the freighters and stuff. Probably not... <laughs> Wait, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Yes. Yes. Oh, we might get it, actually. If the engine turns off on the right-hand side, we got it. Oh, no. <laughs> we got it. Nice. Well. Sucks to be them, everybody. Sucks to be them. Cool. That went pretty well. We actually managed to wipe out a lot of their actual units there. Let's just do a little auto-resolve, and you never know. We may let one of them go. <laughs> we tried, everybody. We tried. Uh, ooh, is that that shoot? Is that... <gasps> it's ballistic! We're keeping this. I'm not letting this go. <laughs> I'm going to use that at some point, and we're going to see how cool it looks. Anyway, apart from having a really cool weapon, let's carry on, shall we? So, we've wiped out the random fleet, everybody. So, I do want to see if we can actually win this one. Oh, let's have a quick look. So, 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 so. Now, I'm pretty aware, by the way, I'm going to be honest here, everybody. There is a military base in the system. If I attack this, a large fleet will probably come over and retake it over. But, we can raid. And if we look inside this base, you will find that there is an alpha core and a corrupted nano forge. Exactly what I was looking for earlier. Basically, all my dreams have come true in one go. It's literally Christmas in July. Or July in Christmas. Whatever it is. I don't know, but it is that thing. So I'm going to see if we can just first off nick this alpha core because it's an alpha core. And after that, we're going to see if we can take the corrupted Narrow Forge. Now, I don't know how exactly how this works, because, um... Oh, I should probably tell you right there. I'm not going to read that, though. <laughs> uh, I think the more Marines you have, the more available forces you can use on these little excursions. So, at least for now, let's just do a double. Because I haven't got enough, I can't do both at the same time. But let's just take... Yeah, let's take this... Why is this one higher? Oh, because it's supported by ground defences. Interesting. Anyway, uh, we'll take that. Alpha Core and Beta Core. Bada bing, bada boom. Launch Raid. We lost 11 brave men, but we got ourselves a super... <laughs> we, we literally just took taken over Skynet, everybody, which is pretty awesome. So, I don't know how long it takes for it to, like, reset. I'm just gonna, like, hang out. Wait, what's that? What's that? There's something big. Look at the radar, everybody. There's something big. I need to see what it is. Oh, that's not that bad. It's just a bunch of... It's, it's That's fine. That's not a problem at all. In fact... Wait, is this a bit crazy? Yes, it is. We're going to do it anyway, though. <laughs> Screw you, Volkov! You're going down! Okay, we take, we've still got a little bit of damage from the previous battle, but most of these vessels are not combat vessels. Also, if you look at the D mods, they are mostly broken as well, which is pretty cool for us. Okay, go, guys. Oh, this battle's actually big enough that it's spawned in the old Nath boys and stuff. That's pretty cool. But like I said, I'm well aware that attacking a, a star base in a place where they have a military base is going to cause me some kind of pain in the future. So I really want to try and nick the good stuff and then just get the hell out of it. Especially the blueprints, because that'd be pretty fun. Oh, yes, game. I'm, I'm well aware. I am well aware. It turns out fighters cannot capture control points. Though why? <laughs> it's probably another question I have. I haven't seen anybody yet. That, they only have like four or five vessels anyway. There's one. There's two. Oh, of course, they're going to spawn in the Ventures, which are the basic game mining vessels. What is that? What is it equipped with? Oh, it's... it's I don't know. <laughs> oh, there's only one way to find out. Hit me with it. I can take it. 
This is Massacre's Threat X mode. Hit me! Oh. Oh, I hate when that happens. Mostly because it ruins my flux. Oh, it's looking at me. I really want to see it fire at something, but it's just not doing it. Is it because I want it to shoot? Is that why? Oh! Oh, it's like a weird um, DNA dance party gun. That's pretty cool. I mean, if you get like a. It just shoots dubstep at you. It's a dubstep gun from Saints Row 2. Is it from Saints Row 2? I don't know. <laughs> I haven't played Saints Row in ages, but I hear it's kind of gone downhill a bit, so. But it is what it is. Also, it's not on Steam, so I just don't realise it's how you even come out. <laughs> if it's not on Steam, I'm sorry, I just don't notice. It's just how it is, guys. It's how it is. Oh, or Xbox Game Pass, one of those two. I'm very, uh, I don't, I don't want to download millions of devices to play games. I want them in one place. Anyways, what am I even talking about? Let's carry on, shall we? <laughs> he's lost it, everybody. He's finally gone insane. Oh, I say finally. He's become more insane. That looks really weak. Though, I'm also confused on why your shields aren't up, my friend. Oh. Okay, we got this. We got this. I'm still going really slow, though. Take this! Okay. You're doing a lot of damage here. Unfortunately for the enemy, if they got a lot of armor tank, if they're going against this cannon, it's not going to go very well for them. This is one of my favorite guns. I think... I love the guns in this faction. Also, there was, used to be a Homeworld mod, which had really, really nice guns as well. They uh, they, they, they were so powerful. They had really long range. They are kind of like this, actually. To be honest, they literally worked the same as this. They shot like dual shots and stuff. Very high range. It was... What? That wasn't me. That wasn't me, okay? Well, it was me, but it wasn't me directly. I didn't press that button. That came from the turret, okay? Read it back. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. <laughs> You're... Your contract's up. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of being a bit... Oh, no! I'm... That was me. That was me. That guy just flew into one of my shots. Is he going to die? If you die, you deserve it at this point. What is that? Oh, it's their point defense, isn't it? I'm pretty sure it is. It's some kind of, like, crazy point defense. Okay, regardless, I'm pretty well. We absolutely smashed it. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to do auto-resolve on these guys as they run away. We've got to be a little bit careful, though, because we are, if you notice, we are getting a little bit low on CR. Wow, okay. Cool. <laughs> can we see if we can... Ah. Oh. I was hoping we might be able to nick some of their cool ships. Ah, oh, I got more of their weird stuff. I'll take them all. Okay. Does that, does that battle really achieve anything for me? No. Uh, not really. <laughs> but I feel better now. Okay, enemy destroyed. Ah! Oh. They've leveled up Tarquinius. He's become more powerful than we could ever imagine. And so has Lindsay. Not really the same feel of the name there, to be honest. I feel like it'd be a bit better, but it's okay. So, uh, what else have we got here? Ah, uh, these skills are kind of a bit... They're kind of... They kind of suck everybody. Ah, that could be pretty handy. Also, do I not have better vessels? Like, should you... Shouldn't you be using something better than that? Wait a minute. I just realized something. This, with this, is amazing, surely, right? So, this is the one where it reloads its gun and can fire a quick session with the siege weapon. So, it means it has more charges, it regenerates faster, has more range. Well, it won't really affect that, but it has less cooldown as well. Surely, this makes it even more powerful than before. And it also comes with gunnery implants increasing its range. And it's an energy weapon increasing its damage. And, um... Yes, <laughs> I can't think of any more ands, but it seems like the right direction we want to be going in. So we're going to take that. It's going to be epic, everybody. Truly epic. Uh, yes, I'm happy with that. Everybody, what is that? It looks bad. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. No, no, no. Wait, go, 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 go. Go! <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Stay back, man. Look, I don't want to fight you. You're clearly better equipped than I am, okay? I just don't want to fight you. Okay, you just stay over there. I'm going to loot around. I'm going to loot your base. I'm going to leave, okay? It's going to be as simple as that. Wait. There's something there. Oh, I might be okay. Let's see if we can get this guy. 
Let's draw him away first and let's see if we can take him down. Oh, he's gone again. Maybe we should just leave everybody. <laughs> In my defense, my ships aren't that good yet. <laughs> and also, I have actually managed to get myself an Alpha Core from this situation. We can come back later. I also, because I have 440 grand, if I come back, I can I can go back to base. I can buy myself some kind of cruiser or capital ship, and it's going to be glorious. Uh, while I'm here, though, should we see if we can raid this base as well? Oh, it's got a... No, 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 not doing that, not doing that. Okay, let's get, let's get out of here. Is there a, um... Hmm. Let's just head back normally. I would not... I don't know if there's a gate around here, unfortunately, so we just have to drive back normally. Okay, let's get out of it. Oh, I can just do this. Ah. And I'm gone. <laughs> They'll never see me again, everybody. I'm completely hidden. So we go back this way. So I, I will say as well, because I actually found a uh, gate in the hero system, which is over here. There was actually a lot of planets I could have looked at. So we actually go back there quickly as well, and we'll see if we can get any cool loot. Because I'm pretty sure there is, by the way. I decided to uh, maybe do it on video instead. <laughs> There's stuff there. That's all I'm going to say, okay? But first, we will, of course, buy myself a cool ship. So let's go this way. I feel like I am going really slow, but I'm not. We also need to try and make sure we get ourselves a um, tug so we can go at maximum speed. I don't think I think we probably need two tugs actually. Actually, I'm not sure. Is it one or two? In theory, I think it's one we need, but we have to find out. Okay, we've reached the point. <clears throat> I said we've reached the point. <laughs> Damn it, guys. Okay, so let's go to the main base first. Actually, how much cargo we got? Uh, let's go to Hero first, because we've got some car capacity we can take with us. Let's go to Hero. Because then we could probably also use the loot we get from there to help us buy an even bigger ship if we can afford it, so... Let's dodge that quickly. Okay, off to Hero. We've got loads of fuel, by the way. Shouldn't be a problem with us going there and coming back. Fuel's, like, quite nice at this point. Uh, let's see. Go to Hero. I like zooming in so you can just see the epicness. So, here we are, Hero! I didn't look at any of this. There is a lot of random stuff just around and about in this location. I don't know if I can actually bother to actually go through all these, but they're here. <laughs> there is also a giant sensor array. I probably should grab this, actually, while I'm here. I mean, why not, right? It increases my sensor range. And we can see stuff further away now. Well, there's actually more than I thought there was. Wait, wait, I don't think there's anything up there. Let's have a look. What is it? Oh, wait, there's actually someone here. Oh, it's just like a random scavenger? Ah, oh, weird. I like how they're just circling the supply cache and just not taking it for some reason. <laughs> well, it's mine now, so screw you. <laughs> like, damn it. <laughs> so we spent two years looking at this thing. Ooh, what is happening over here? What is going on? I'm joining that battle. Let's go, let's go. I was not expecting it to be about here, by the way. This is completely random. <laughs> I don't know why this is happening. Okay. This is, this is why I'm happy that I increased the maximum battle limit, because it's going to be a gigantic battle. Okay, let's go, everybody. Let's go. Deploy everybody. Huge battle. Uh, I'm going to send my squad off, and we're just going to go. Everyone's going to go and attack that nav boy over there. We're going to be squad right. We're going to go over there, take the right flank, and we're going to enjoy it. And you're probably going to die in, like, one hit, but we'll see. It looks like the AI is going the other way. Ooh, I like these ships. These are all base game ships, by the way, if you can't tell. But they are pretty cool looking ships. I do love the aesthetic, especially the Fury. Did we see a Fury earlier in the debris field? I'm pretty sure we did. It doesn't intrigue me enough to get myself one, but... This is either going to be a really good idea, it's going to split their fleet up, or it's going to mean their entire fleet's going to come and kill me. Either way, I'll have to deal with it regardless. Oh no, their fleet's up here already. <laughs> oh no. Well, we're holding the brunt of the fleet off everybody. It's up to us. Don't die. That ship needs to go. <laughs> that ship needs to go, everybody. Oh, it's a real strike. It's not even a pirate one. That's pretty cool. What kind of pirates are these? Don't even have pirate ships. 
Okay, good. We're going to kind of be on the flank and we can kind of go in afterwards. So that's pretty cool. Let's see if we can kill this guy. Why, hello there. I was expecting some more epicness from that, but it didn't work out that well. A level 10 sh shuttle, by the way. Can we appreciate that? <laughs> it's a bit crazy. Yeah, we kind of uh, chose the wrong way of doing this, didn't we? Let's, um... I thought they would have deployed more units than this, to be honest. Get rid of that. Don't worry about it. We're going to go and do an engagement on... Probably just the Venture I'm going to go with. And let's also just do a random control point on all the different objectives and stuff as well. Okay, done. Cool. I'm a big fan. I'm your biggest fan, sir. I want to see... <laughs> Maybe I'll get, I'll get bored at like, the end of the series. We'll just do like a fleet of like 20 sea ships. <laughs> we'll just see what happens. <laughs> it's fine. We'll do it at some point. Okay. See, that thing's already run out of uh, combat readiness, guys. That ship is awful. It's fine. Although a lot of the CR problems are due to it having the elite package, which reduces its CR by 50%, which is ridiculous, by the way. Um, you just knocked me out of my way, man. I, I had a perfect aiming path and you just ruined it. I was actually looking at the screen there, sorry. If you're wondering where I was aiming, that's why. <laughs> I was looking at my watch. <laughs> anyway, I was like, when's dinner ready? Never, because I haven't made it yet. <laughs> Ooh, I was a bit close there with the old... Um... Oh, that was sad. Get some of those deployed in the battlefield. Okay, so as it's already declining, let's just get those to retreat. Oh, I did forget I was going to put on the old um, auto CR retreat thing, but I just completely forgot about it. Uh, where's the other one? Oh, he's there. Uh oh. Oh, I thought I got it as well. I, I, oh, damn it. This is a pretty cool looking ship as well. It's like a crab. But in space. Oh, it's got that. I, that ability is really annoying. What's that carry with it on? I think it was called the... Oh, I can't remember. Mora? Something like that. We're going to talk about them. It's really annoying. Because every time you use it, it just wastes all the torpedoes that get shot at it. We will crack this egg. No, stop it. <laughs> You're ruining it. Nailed it. Well, that was, I don't know why there was a gigantic battlefield in the middle of nowhere, but there was. <laughs> and we got to take part in it. Held in reserve. Oh, they have a gargantuan amount of utility ships. Oh, I see. I'm taking... We're taking that. <laughs> I don't care what the game says. We're doing it. Some of them got away, but that's going to be a lot of loot, surely. Oh, more. <laughs> or not, apparently. Or not. Okay, well... Yes! Oh, I'm a big fan. Okay, so we, we'll take over. So NASA can be our new... Uh, st steady... I love going steady, everybody. It's perfect. So we we'll take this with us. Uh, with her, with us. Let's see. Promote to ship command. Yes. I am 100% certain at this point. Um, where is she? Oh, I haven't decided yet. <laughs> idiot. Where do you think she's going to be? She's not in the game, you idiot. Okay. We'll put her over there. You can become the Maximus. Uh, Do I level up at all? I have. Oh! There's no hole. A true spacer. Oops. Can't make home. All your ships are almost always recoverable if lost in combat. Unless blown up by their own siege frigate. <laughs> That's how we lost it. Didn't the siege guy blow up the shuttle? I'm pretty sure he did. Anyway, ships lost in combat have 75% if 60 point points are higher or 90% chance to avoid D mods. Beautiful. Chance to remove 
one D mod per month for a random ship. Beautiful. Chance to quickly remove one D mod from a newly acquired ship. Beautiful. 5% more comet readiness per S mod. What is S mod? Is S mod like the permanent good mod? I think that's what it is. Anyway, we've done it, everybody. I now longer no longer have to deal with comments saying, you never restore your ships. Still, everybody, the game does it for me, okay? It's fine. Don't worry about it. Done. Okay. Enemy has been cowed down. There was a giant battle for no real reason. I'm going to go this way. Okay, let's go down here. Was someone just getting attacked up there? <laughs> Something was happening. So there is another scavenging field and another another scavenging field. Is there anything in these? No. No, there's not. But there is an irradiated world. Let's do a quick survey. Class. Oh, it's ruins here. Ooh. Let's see what we get. I want to find... Um, I don't know what I want, actually. Oh. This. This is what I wanted. <laughs> There you go, everybody. I didn't know I wanted it, but now I have it. I knew I always wanted it. Perfect. I really should have dropped off some stuff first because the lack of space is a bit annoying. Um, that's worth £30 per unit. No, I don't need that. <laughs> Take it back. I don't want it. So we now actually now have ourselves a corrupted nano forge. Not brilliant because it actually seeps out certain destruction. It's It literally just kills you if you put it on a planet. So, oh, does it? It does, yeah. Habitable worlds causes pollution, which becomes permanent. We probably need to not use this <laughs> on that world. <laughs> Maybe we need to find a better one because that's just going to kill everybody. It'd be great though if we capture a so does, if we capture a star base, you can use it on there without a problem though. Very handy. Not so handy in every one, but it's fine. Anyway, so that's pretty cool. There was also a desert world, and also something over this way. That looked like it was moving to me. Who are you? Why are there so many giant fleets here? That's a mercenary one, isn't it? I don't know. It hasn't turned to attack me, so I think we're good. Maybe. What is going on? What, why is this place ridiculous? Anyway, uh, there's a planet. Class 5. I'm surprised this is a class 5, by the way. Is it because the ruins are so large? Because it has like 25, 50, 100... 75 hazard. Not that great, everybody. Not that great. Oh, we could actually colonize it. But I don't want to. Uh, oh, maybe we should. It could become pretty handy. I think we'll do it anyway. What's the problem? Oh, thank you, game. <laughs> just, just read and it will tell you. Oh. oh. <laughs> I thought that was a nano forge. Ah, oh, sadness. It looks like a nano forge. I mean, like if you compare these two, they do look pretty similar. If anything, I would say it's actually the same graphic. They just changed it around a little bit. Anyway, uh, I'm taking it. Wait, I'll take that. I'll take all these organs. You can't go wrong with all these organs. Though I'm still upset about the lack of space in my ship. Why is it so bad? What are we using all this stuff on? Ah, damn it. Um, oh, that's also quite good as well. That could be... Get rid of that. Though, the lack of space... No, I'm so sorry. Wait, we can establish comedy just immediately just dump the stuff. It's fine. It's fine. This is going to cause a big problem. This is a desert world, right? What would a desert world be called? I've already used June. That's like my only name. <laughs> Damn it, me. It's a mining world, right? Um, uh, I really have no idea. Can we rename stuff afterwards? Oh, you can rename it later. That's fine, then. I'm going to... Let's just do this. Uh, these suck. These aren't real names. They're awful. So I'm going to call it Dust. Which is also awful. <laughs> I'm not going to pretend it's not. So this is clearly going to become a mining well. But later on. Because right now we're going to turn it into a... Void extraction. Is, there, is it because there's no atmosphere? No, it says it's high gravity. So why can we build void extraction? That doesn't make any sense, surely. Let's not question it. We're not going to build that anyway. Tech mining. Yes. We do tech mining, and then later on, we will double back around and we'll make it into a mine. 
problem solved. This is very far. It's got negative 42% <laughs> access, so it's pretty cursed. It's going to probably cost me a lot of money, this place. It's fine. Um, I could, in theory, dump my... No, we're going to keep the super core for later on. The, uh, the super beta core. I guess what we could do, we could just install the beta. Yeah, we'll keep. We'll use this one here. No, no, I don't want to do that. No, I want to. I want to put stuff on it, game. I won't let me. Okay, never mind. I will put the beta core on there, and we'll keep the other core for a proper car, and we'll be fine later on. It'd be fine. Okay, done. Uh, can you resupply me some units? Because I've just probably killed myself <laughs> by doing this. Because now I'm going to have absolutely no crew and it's going to be a complete disaster. Um, take it all, take it all, take it all, take it all. Okay, I'm going to dump the stuff in the resource stockpile. The game can just use this as stockpile. It's fine. They can just deal with this themselves. Probably want to keep that. We can probably sell that for loads of money. We'll keep those. I'm actually just going to do the, the button. Even though none of the bit stuff there actually would help in this situation, I'm going to put it there anyway. <laughs> so, we do that. Uh, let's... Go back home. Oh, also why I'm here. Did I miss there's a weapon cache over there? Well, clearly I did, because there's a weapon cache over there. Are you trying to kill me? Oh no. I don't think we can fight that. They know that I'm injured. Okay. We have to disengage. Screw you guys! <laughs> Those bastards, everybody. They knew that I was weakened because of the lack of uh, stuff. Where's the gate? I need to get out of it. We'll be back. We'll be back. Oh, he's been killed anyway. Well, in that sense, let's just go and get the weapon cache and relieve. They knew. They knew. <laughs> they knew, everybody. We've got some very damaged ships. Let's grab the weapon cache and get the hell out of here. It did say it was a small weapon cache in their defense. That was pretty sad, though. <laughs> okay, let's go. I think we should still have enough money to buy myself a new cruiser or something. Um, let's just teleport over here. Uh, I need crew, believe it or not. I know you're shocked, but it is a thing I need. Excellent. Give me crew before everybody dies. <laughs> I need crew really badly. Uh, first off, let's also get a, more of these guys than before. No! Oh, damn it, game. Done. Okay, sorted. Um, I'm keeping that. Get rid of all this random stuff I have. I don't really want it. Got to make sure I don't accidentally sell the... <laughs> Really important stuff I need in the future. Okay, we keep all this stuff. What did this do, by the way? I didn't even look what it was, sorry. Combat Drone Replicator. Co-Combine. Uh, increases currently ground defense by 1.5. That's pretty badass. What also is badass is that I can sell organs to the Imperium for money. There you go. <laughs> we got money again. Perfect. What is this? Not what I need. Okay, so... It's time, everybody. It is time. Can I buy myself an epic ship? I can make it. I can get a light cruiser, or we can get a Sebastos cruiser. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to save now because sometimes I get so carried away with building ships, it takes up the rest of the video. So I have to redo it again and do like a preset build. Otherwise, I just spend the entire time just talking about ship designs. It's a problem I have. I'm sorry. Anyway, so we got that. This ship I have used before in a previous video attempt, and it is interesting. It is interesting. It's got a giant photon beam cannon, which sounds pretty fun, but it's quite limited in what else it can do. This guy is going to be a missile forge, but it also means that it can actually house a bunch of like ballistic missiles on the front there. So you've got two different slots for heavy weapons. So it's kind of a bit like, what one do I want more? Or do we save up a little bit more and we got the Dominus Battlecruiser? Because that seems to me like it would be the funnest way of doing it. 
I'm going to go with that. I'm taking executive decision, everybody. We are saving up a little bit more, and we're getting Dominus Battlecruiser. I mean, yes, there's also a Caesar, but this guy is just more my kind of thing. <laughs> At least for me to fly personally. I think we'll probably get this as a personal ship I can fly around with. Anyway, uh, what we we'll do for now, then, what we do is not sell any of this. This is all very important for us. We're going to probably go and do a bounty to get the money. And then we can come back. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. There's a lot of stuff over here, isn't there? Why are these bounties so ridiculous? There's literally a battle star. A literal battle star. Okay, let's go to the... I thought I got this mission. Uh, we'll do this one. That'd be enough. By the time we get there and come back, we would already have enough stuff. It'd be fine. Okay, so what I'm going to do then... Oh, also, I need to do something else. I need to also grab... If I go into the thing here. Um, oh, it's not for sale. No. Ah, oh, sadness. Let's try over here. I need to get some uh, basic materials to set up the com relay... Just a com relay, actually. Yeah, I just need to set up a com relay at that base we just cap uh, in dust, so we can actually do it remotely, just for the future. Anyway, what is that noise? What? Pirate raid, hero star system, thirty-one. No. How dare you? Okay, change plans. Change plans. They dare attack me. Ooh. It's not that much money, guys. It's not that much. And it's a big death machine. I think we need this to secure ourselves in, in the interim of fighting the pirates. It's fine. Okay, I'm taking it. It's happened. Um, how do I want to equip it, though? Oh, I'm, I, I've got a mind. I've got my mind's eye is telling me a fit, and it's already been established. So, hi, main guy at the front, hyper velocity driver, locked in. Actually, not be better if we do it this way. Uh, two high velocity drivers. They shoot anything that is nearby. Anti shield, long range, perfect. Next up, we have a Sodas cannon shooting from the front here into the face of the enemy. Amazing. Next up, we have a point defense around and a. Yes, okay, perfect. So, let's do point defense. That is the point defense. Damn it, game. <laughs> there wasn't enough in the shop. Uh... It must be organized. We can't have the same thing elsewhere. Okay, so that's point defense done. These guys are going to be the main... Well, the shooty forward guys. So, what we do here... Suppression. Maybe. No, what I really want though, I don't want this 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 this, this subpar. Subpar equipment. I want the stuff that this guy has. I want these Arcus Auto Cannons and Lux Repeaters. That's what I want, everybody. We'll quickly dart back to the media post. Mender, Mender, whatever it's called. We'll grab hopefully the weapons I want. Oh no, I just bought a giant cruiser from a black market. <laughs> stay back, guys, stay back. They can't catch me. I'm too fast. I have the speed. The need for speed. Okay. So, back to what I was doing. Hopefully this place is a bit more memeable to my, my needs. I don't even know what these guns are. They look pretty cool, though. But once again, they have not got the guns I wanted. <laughs> Damn it, game. What is up with the only... Oh, I sold these, didn't I? Oh, they haven't got what I want. Why are all my dreams ruined in this game? All of them. Every single one of my dreams are ruined. Every time I go to design a ship, everybody. This might work, though. Wait, let's just do a quick... We'll try this Volkov Industry gun. We'll see if it works. Um, mass driver, anti-shield, suppression. This may be a temporary fit until we get what I actually want, to be honest. Um... It does damage armor. This is an anti-armor gun. We'll try it. We'll give it a, we'll give it a good college try, everybody. Um, I guess we can also do some small anti-shield as well, in case they having trouble with other stuff. Let's try this. What can possibly go wrong? I think it's a kind of workout. 
So, uh, let's... What we do, because we actually unlocked it last episode. Integrated targeting unit. There's no reason not to have this. It's the better version. Done. Massive rain. There is also these, by the way, but I'm really not a fan of missiles, okay? I'm sorry. This is how it is. Anyway, so, moving on. Big problem with flux. <laughs> Big deficit there. Let's have a quick look. Also, while I'm here, let's just have a quick look as well. Uh, it's got a turbo feeder. I want to go for the range one, I think, on this. Or do I? I'm trying to think for a second, everybody. This is what I was on about earlier. I might go down the rabbit hole and not do anything for the rest of the episode again. What's its speed? Where does it say its speed? It can increase the speed by 20. If I do this. It reduces its... Wait. <laughs> Wait. Wait. This could work. This could actually work. It's kind of like having loads of stuff at the same time. This elite package. I reckon this, I reckon this is going to be great. I think this is going to work. I know I'm, go I know I'm going out on a, a limb here, everybody, but I'm pretty sure the HMS victory will win everything. Okay, let's just do a quick test, shall we? While well, I'm here. Uh, what do we want to test it against? Doesn't matter. It's a super it's a super ship. One of those. One of the no wait, not one of those. One of these. Some of those. So it's got the elite package installed. It's got whatever this gun is. Oh, it's cool. Okay. It's literally the same gun, but it's only seen shooting once. So my issue right now is probably going to be maneuverability. Oh, so, okay. I thought it had a, um, it's got a front facing shield. Okay, maybe this ship needs some more um, firepower for the size, everybody. It is very tanky, though, at the moment. Maybe I need to put on a maneuverability thing for it. Its armor is very powerful, though. It's got a lot of staying power, but like it's, it's it's struggling a lot with being flanked, which is not great for us. Maybe it does need like a movability perk. But look at that damage though. That damage is really good there. Let's see what it does against a cruiser. Let's just do it. Let's kill this guy first. That's nice. I'm digging this. Okay, that guy is having a problem. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Do you know what? I'm into it. I'm into it. This is going to work. It's not the most powerful ship in the world, but bear in mind, we're going to put this into battle, everybody, and we're going to have a leader in it. It's going to be better. I don't know if I want to use it, though. I'll use it temporarily. We'll see how it, we'll see how it does. <laughs> we, I'll, I'll, I'll see how it does in combat, because I'm going to give it more movement speed and higher flux. I'm going to give it more peak operation time. I'm going to give it better range and also better auto firing. And what is this? More ordnance and stuff as well. So I'll take control of this myself. We give my previous one to... S oh, do you know, it is a bit slow for me, actually. I take my... We'll put something else on charge. Let's give it to... Oh, 
Tom Cruise. Tom Cruise can take that. If you go back to my one, I'll keep it. I like ships that are a little bit faster. The other one was a lot, it was a lot bigger that other ship, the battle cru cruiser, but it was faster. I'm pretty sure. I'll take that. I'll still mess up now, isn't it? I've messed it all up. <laughs> it's all over the place. Main ship done. Uh, this needs to be. Are we good? Everyone happy? Yeah, yeah. It's looking pretty good. I'll take that, everybody. I'll take that. Okay, so what we're doing then? Let's get more crew because we just got a way bigger ship. Oh, what about its speed? How slow is this? Same speed. That's fine. Uh, while I'm here then, is there a chance we can get ourselves a tug? Because that will save me some hassle in the future. No. <laughs> there are no tugs here. Ah! ah. Maximum speed, everybody. Maximum speed. Okay, awesome. We are fully good to go, boy. Let's head back to Hero and defend our colony. Uh, where was it again? Wait, wh when was it? Sorry, that was more, that was the more prevalent question. Is it going to mark it as an important event? I'm being attacked by pirates. Shouldn't that not be a big problem? Okay. Uh, raid is coming from there. I wonder if we can just go over there and kill them before they even leave. Yes, it's the answer, by the way. That's exactly what we're going to do. Uh, let's go and... <laughs> I don't want to wait for 31 days. That's ages. We will go to them. It's fine. They can't destroy me if I'm already there. Ooh, my monthly income went down a lot. It's probably because... I have a very expensive colony, which doesn't make any money. Okay, so... It's literally from here, right? Let's go over that way. Yeah, let's have a look quickly. Yeah, it's, uh, it's not great over there. Oh, wait. If it's the end of the month, did I get any... Um... Ah, it's because it's just created. Eventually, you should get a... Um... If you have ruins, it randomly gives you equipment or whatever from the ruin exploration. So we may just randomly find some... Well, it's going to be... Ooh. We may just randomly find some blueprints. You never know. That wasn't really what I wanted to happen, but it still kind of works out. Okay, let's go down this way. I love how the uh, noise changes as you run around there. I love that feature of the game. Okay, so I think the pirate base is in here, right? That was the longest... Oh my god, everybody. What the hell just happened there? I might have to restart the game. If it cuts away, you know why, okay? <laughs> that, I don't know what... I think I just got download... I think I just downloaded a virus into my brain or something. I'm pretty sure I'm now a cyborg. I've become a cyborg. Okay. Enemy base spotted. You think you can defeat me? You probably can. Is that the base? Oh yeah, get out of it, get out of it. Nah, nah, where do you think? Yes, yeah, you go into that sort of... <laughs> I, I, I can't believe what I just witnessed. It just flew into a sun, it, they're totally fine. How is that even possible? <laughs> that, was, that was amazing. Okay, we've tempered the issue there. They've been defeated. Okay, there's no subset this time. It's fine. You will not destroy me. I will destroy you. Do you not understand the situation here? Deploy the fleet. We deploy the big boys first. Oh, wait, including you. And nobody else. At least for now. Let's go. You gotta be careful, guys. We are fighting against a space station here. It has guns, okay? Especially you. Tom Cruise, be careful there. Oh, my awful fighters. I need to replace at some point. My dreams of killing that fighter squad by myself really not work out that well. Oh! Oh, no! Okay, the last missile was a dud. It's fine. <laughs> this bounced off. Can you cover me, Falcon? Stop trying to uncover me! Wow, that was a bad start to the battle, wasn't it? That was a very bad start. I just got absolutely wrecked there. Uh, let's call the backup anyway. Screw it. They'll be fine. I literally can't defend against this barrage of death, everybody. It's a complete disaster. Am I out of range yet? I can't even see the station anymore. 
If anything can tank that, it's going to be this guy. Let's hope so, anyway. Do you know what? He's not doing a lot of damage to that shield. Oh, no. Gage! But the good news is, while he was doing that, the rest of my navy destroyed the other dudes. Oh no, did <laughs> the death just leave? <laughs> why Why not even bring you into the battle, man? The walking fodder weapon. If that guy pulls off a... Um, look at that dodging. That guy's doing a great job. Oh wait, no, I thought he was dodging, but I just realised he dodged the attacks and split the Invictus in half. <laughs> Damn it, man! You didn't take any damage! Oh, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble. I'm gonna die next. I need to leave, I need to leave. I, I cannot handle this, this gun. We are winning, though. We have dis disabled the enemy. Uh, with a lot of damage on my part, but... Nice! That went pretty well. Apart from the uh, Maximus dodging and killing the ship thing, but apart from that, was fine. But it's okay, because this might get removed. It wasn't, but it could be removed next time. You never know. Uh, we'll take all that. Does that mean I've now defeated the chance of a pirate base attack? I don't know. I have no idea. Does that work that way? Did they already leave? Oh no, no! Um, we've made a grave mistake, everybody. I attacked the pirate base in the attempt that I would save Hero, but in the process, they already left and are attacking me. <laughs> no. How long is it going to take us to get there? Talk to me, game. Ten days. Oh, that's oh, that's at current speed though. Okay, transverse jump. We're going. We're going. Maximum speed. Go, go, go. We can make it. We can make it. Oh, no, not this again. Screw it. No. Okay. I don't... Ooh. Get inside. <laughs> uh oh, what's happening? The game's confused. Ooh. Get to the gate. I haven't got time for you. I'm saving my 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 capital. It's not my capital. The place I hit, I colonized. I want to see the 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 difference. It's three days into arrival. <laughs> it's all worked out, everybody. Uh, all according to my plan. We have arrived at, at the perfect time here. There is a slight problem with the complete lack of supplies in a few seconds, but apart from that, it's worked out exactly as I was planned. It's totally fine. Uh, have you got any... Not really. He hasn't got any supplies, fizzy. Okay. We're going to save here, everybody. And we're going to deal with the pirate raid in tomorrow's episode. I hope that everyone has enjoyed this extremely chaotic video. Uh, if you can tell, this is a video recorded in the evening because my temperament seems to be completely different and I seem to be more crazy. I think it's due to the amount of food I consumed. It just makes me ridiculous. Anyway, everybody, anyway, thank you for watching. As always, please subscribe and comment below and I will see you all next time. Bye.